St. John's wort um, may help with migraines, but there are a few side effects that you really should know about. So how the heck do migraines occur and why? It's a good question. One theory is an artery near the head region um, where the skin is gets larger. This in turn signals inflammation, which is the body's way of coping with injury and causes the pain and throbbing feeling. Now St. John's wort was named after St. John the Baptist and was discovered around 400 BC. If you're not sure who St. John was, I don't blame you. A lot of people probably don't. He was sort of the one that was announcing Jesus' coming, sort of like a prophet. St. John's wort helps change neurotransmitters in the brain and may ease headaches. This all sounds good, right? Of course, the bad news, there's a, a dark side to this. This herb has something known as MAOI, uh, which raises something called tyramine. And this, in turn, raises something known as blood pressure. The risk is blood pressure may rise very quickly by taking this herb, and a blood vessel in someone's brain may burst, resulting in permanent brain damage, which does occur sometimes. So in conclusion, I don't think it's worth it to take this herb, and there's much better choices out there. To learn about these choices, I've actually written a free report that goes over about how to choose supplements, herbs, vitamins, I go over how to spot harmful products and which ones are good. Completely free. And to check it out, just go ahead and click on the link below this video. And I hope you enjoy it.